Hey everyone, this is Alex with Web Hosting Canada, and today we're just going to do a quick video to demonstrate how to uninstall WordPress using Softaculous. So I'm here in the Web Hosting Canada client area, and up here in the second tab, I've got my uh, test site installation of WordPress. And for the purposes of this tutorial, I've decided that I want to get rid of this installation of WordPress. So I'm going to go back to the client area here, and I'm going to click on Go to cPanel, and that'll open up in a new tab. And now I'm going to click on, under Popular Tools, the one-click apps installer. And that'll open up Softaculous. And so you'll notice here I have uh, installations, and I'm going to click on that. And that takes me to the list of the installations that I have on this account. And here we see solutions-web.ca. And if we go all the way over here to the right, there's a big red X, which if we click on it, will remove the installation of WordPress. So uh, evidently at this point, I've, I've done my backups. I've made up my mind that I want to uninstall WordPress. So I'm going to click on that red X and it's just going to confirm what I want to do. It's going to ask me if I want to remove the directory. And by that, it means uh, remove the contents of the directory. It won't actually delete the directory that it's installed in, but it will delete the contents of the folder. It's going to ask me if I want to remove the database, which is the database the website's connected to, and I also want to, un un to remove that. And it's also going to ask me if I want to remove the database user. So we're just going to leave all of those checked and we're going to come down here and click on Remove Installation. And it's going to warn me these actions are irreversible. Are you sure you want to remove this installation? And I'm going to say OK. So depending on the size of the installation, this might take a bit longer. But because it was just a fresh installation, it didn't take very long at all. And you can see it was removed successfully. And so if I go back here, to my uh, website and I refresh, uh, that brings us back to the a great new website is coming soon Web Hosting Canada page. So that's really all that there is to uninstalling a WordPress website when you're using Softaculous. I hope that you got some benefit out of this video. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments and please do hit that subscribe button. I'll catch you in the next video.